What is up, guys? The owner of Best FIFA Clips and Tips here, and I'm bringing you a gold center back trading method. This is the first of its kind. Um, this is by Mr. SHP Gaming. Um, his link will be in the description below. I hope you guys um, enjoy this, but um, the title is self explanatory. You just trade gold center backs. I'm going to let him take it from here, though. And uh, if this helps you in any way, hit that like button. If you want to see more trading tips, hit the subscribe button and let us know what you think about this video in the comments below. I'm going to let him take it from here. Alright, thanks. What is going on, guys? SHP here with another FIFA 13 trading video. The last one went down so well, so I thought, what the hell? I'll just pop another one out. And this is again trading with centre backs, which is definitely the best position to trade with on FIFA 13. And this time, I will be trading with gold players. They're not rare players. Gold rare players are really hard to trade with, as I said before. But going in here, we are going with uh, centre backs in the Premier League, and this is with Arsenal and French. And no, it's not the informed Sanya, it is Laurent Koscielny. He is an awesome player with great pace, great strength. And what a better, who's there, is not a better player to trade with in my opinion. As you flick through here in any formations, you see the good formations are for 2, 3k. And uh, there's so much uh, room for profit here. So I first want to go straight away into the most popular formation, 442. And uh, you just search for the bin by now. You do that with every single popular formation. As you see here, I saw one going on the bid for 2,200, so I immediately see the buy now of 1,300. So that's immediate profit from just searching at the bin by now. And I'll put that up and make at least 700 pa uh, coin profit, and that will sell within a couple of minutes. So that is a great start. And I was going to buy these, but then I thought I'll look onto different formations to see if there's more profit margin to be made. So I was skipping through. And then you change formation and you change it by now until you find the bin price. But sometimes the bin price is too high. So you just have to leave it. And if that's not the case, you go on to open bid and set yourself a maximum uh, price on your Kashani. So you're always going to make profit really. As I do look through for the bin by now. As my search engine was lagging a bit, I clearly asked. And I do place a couple of bids on. Because it's no trouble in like trying for it there and we now go on to the uh, next formation that search for the bin price and it was unfortunately very high as I kept scrolling and scrolling and nothing was really to be found but if you just repeat this process especially at a dead time in the market you can make yourself thousands and thousands of coins in one night because you're making like 800 coins a player and if this isn't working for you, there's always other alternatives, as I'm about to show you now. But I, first of all, I was searching for another bin by now. And these do come across in the 352, and I will buy that later. Well, I would buy that at any time. I just want to show you the next player here, who is also in the Premier League, and is also a very strong and fast centre-back. If you haven't guessed who it is yet, it is Jan Vertonghen. And the first thing you always do is you get it so it would be just him. So you don't have to flick through all the pages to find the right players. And the second, you just search any formation, no buy now, just to get a feel of the market and just see what is going on. And it was immediate that these prices were pretty much exactly the same as Koscielny's. And a few guys tried to price fix him in this terrible formation. And that is the worst thing you could do when trading. Just price fix players. That is definitely not what you want to do. Especially in a bad formation, maybe in a good formation, but that he's really going to lose money there. But I did, I got a feel for the market, so I then searched for the popular formations and tried to find the bin by now. And unfortunately, again, this time in the market, it was quite high. And as you can see in the top right-hand corner, I've made a lots of coins so far from my centre-back uh, last time, my trading method. And I just flicked through the buy nows, and I eventually did find one with the Andertongan. And I thought I'd buy that as I could at least make 400 coins profit, and that's a bare minimum. So the rest was going to be, so that's more pure profit for me as I put him up for 2,000 odd. And we're moving on already, and this was looking really good. And if you just repeat this process like twice a day, one in the morning, one in the evening, 
you'll make yourself 15k a day at least and that's just with this method which is not very tiring it doesn't take much effort you literally just have to scroll through and find the bin by now or be in lucky on open bid in the selected formation i would say i would say 352 4212 and 442 and 433 i would say that's another popular formation but i do go into open bids again see what's going on and the inform uh, card did uh, bring his other c uh, cards price up as he's got more awareness now and normally it's the other way around but I don't know that's really weird but if that's not working there is a third centre back you could choose and this isn't the biggest profit margins but it always does work and that is uh, Figaro who has rised in price dramatically again I think it's due to his inform card but as you can see here I was just scrolling through and the prices of uh, I used to do this a while back and I would buy them for about 400 and sell them for 800 but now I'll have to buy them for 800 and sell them for about 1500 but I do find a bin buy now in a great formation 433 and that's at least 500 coins made there already and this is what I mean you're always just finding yourself great bargains and just remember to repeat the process and it will always work and it will always be beneficial to you. If you do want to see an episode 3, 10 likes and leave a comment on what else you want to see from me. So once again, please like, comment, subscribe and peace.